Hi, this is David with David's Tutorials. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how I use Camtasia to remove a click pop noise in the audio of a video that I'm editing. This could be the very first in a series of how I edit video. And if I have some feedback that people want to hear more of that, I'll be very happy to do so. What I have here is a video in which I use the word snack and you can hear the K on the end of snack turns out to be a little bit too loud. Let's listen. This delicious snack. There we have it. There's snack. Listen to the K on the end of snack. Delicious snack. Okay. The K right here is just a little bit too loud. So what I want to do is edit that little K out of there. You can see it right here in the waveform. I'm going to right click on the waveform and make sure we have edit audio selected and we know it's selected because we see that green bar on the back half. So what I want to do now is add audio points to this waveform. First I have to select it again. Now I'm going to position my playhead just before that. Okay it's right on it. Let's back up one frame like that. And now I'm going to position the cursor right over the line and right click it and add an audio point. I'm going to back it up one more frame. I'm going to add another audio point. Now I'm going to add two audio points after the K. There's on the K. Uh, let's get it right there. We'll add an audio point there. Right click. Add audio point. Forward one frame. Right click, add audio point. Now the reason I add audio points is because I want the volume both before and after what I am removing to be the same. So this is the start audio change. This is the end audio change. And if I grab the line in between the two middle points and drag it down, you'll see that now I can reduce the volume of just that area. If I did it any other way, then I would reduce the area of the entire clip, which I don't want to do. So let's listen to it now. Just snack. Perfect. You can still hear the K, but it's not too loud. That's all there is for this video. If you like it, give us a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe and click the bell icon to be notified whenever there's another new tutorial here on David's Tutorials.